I know it was right to sink her, and I would do the same again. I know it was right to sink her, and I would do the same again. Well, I mainly do the catering here. I like cooking and I do the shopping and always a big batch of cooking at the weekend. If we keep our standards and our vision bright. Um, um, it's the state's job to find a job. It's the state's job to house me. Um, it's the state's job to look after my family. No, um, no. Pocket television sets, pocket television sets. I think that in their hearts, people know that our way is the way... Pocket television sets. Terrible, terrible conflicts. Um, they use their power against every housewife, every child, every school, every pensioner. Pocket television sets. You want division, you want conflict, you want hatred. There it was. It was that which Thatcherism, Thatcherism, if you call it that. Our way, you remember, you remember. Um, so that is not in doubt. I'm sorry, what did you say? I have only one thing to say. You turn if you want to. The ladies, not for turning. Enough is enough. No, enough is enough. Mm. It's a lowering, not a raising. It's enough a is enough. That's, that's it. That's, that's, that's it. Uh, Mrs. Thatcher, why, when the uh, Belgrano, the Argentinian mm. battleship, was outside the exclusion zone and actually sailing away from the Falklands, uh, why did you give the orders to sink it? But it was not sailing away from the Falklands. It was in an area which was a danger to our ships. When it was sunk, that ship which we had found was a danger to our ships. We had given warnings that all ships in those areas, if they represented a danger to our ships, were vulnerable. I know it was right to sink her, and I would do Mrs. the same Thatcher, you started again. your answer by saying it was not sailing away from the Falklands. It was on a bearing of 280, and it was already west of the Falklands. So I'm sorry, but I cannot see how you can say it was not sailing when away from the Falklands. Was, when it was sunk. When it was sunk. It was a danger to our ship. No, ships. but you have just said at the beginning of your answer that it was not sailing away from the Falklands. And I'm asking you to correct yes, that statement. but it's within an area outside the exclusion zone, which I think what you are saying is sailing away. No, I'm not, Mrs. Which Stafford. way it was which facing was at the time. A, I danger to our ships. Mrs. Thatcher, I am saying that it was on a bearing 280, which is a bearing just north of west. It was already west of the Falklands, and therefore nobody with any imagination can put it sailing other than away from the Falklands. Mrs. I'm sorry, I forgot your name. Mrs. Gould. Mrs. Gould. Um, when you know, the orders were given to sink it, and when it was sunk, it was... Un llamado telefónico de mi hijo mayor. That night, my other son called, and they asked me whether I'd been listening to the radio. I said, no, I'd been watching the television. When it was sunk, that ship which we had found was a danger to our ship. My goodness me, I live with many, many anxious days uh, and nights. He said he'd been listening to some ridiculous stories on a foreign radio station, but he didn't say anything else. The attack on the Belgrano. I know it was right to sink her and I would do the same again. So, I went to bed, and early the next morning I switched on the radio, and the first thing I hear is that the Belgrano has been attacked. It was right to sink her. Well, now, you accept that, do you? Uh, no, well, I don't. I'm sorry, it was. It was um, you must accept, you must accept, you must... Que se hundió, hundieron, el, bombardearon el crucero general Belgrano. I rushed to the phone to call my son and my sister. I would do the same again. And it turned out that they had been up all night listening to the news. That was the start of my long night. My long nights. The next day, no news. On Tuesday, nothing. 
That afternoon, the parish priest at the church just across the road from my home said the special mass. You must accept, you must accept, to accept. All my neighbors and relatives came to pray for my son's safe return. But it was not to be. Would you please let me answer? When we changed the... No fue así. Desgraciadamente no fue así. Would you please... Fue muy angustiante. He was just a boy. He was six foot five. So happy. So healthy. I lived with the responsibility for a very long time. Oh well. He wouldn't like to see me crying like this. I would do the same again. No, no, no. What sort of society do you think we'd have? What sort of society? Society, society? Hate? No, no. Um, it's not a question of hating it. I firmly believe they use their you want power division. against you their want members. conflict. You want hatred. Remember, they them. want us to abandon. Abandon. Remember, remember, remember. No, no, no. We're never going to change. I'll let you into a secret. You remember terrible conflicts. Today, the liberals have new allies. I'll let you into a secret. The ladies, not for turning. But we would not be prepared to agree to trust in one another about each other's approach. Our way is the way. The ladies, not, not. The ladies, not, not for, 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 for turning, turning, turning. The ladies, not. One moment. There it was. It was that, which Thatcherism, if you call it that, that is gone. Now another one. Just rejoice at that news. Right, please go ahead. Abandon ours and leave them in the hands of the I wonder what the right honourable gentleman's policy, policy is. Yes, he would rather have the poor or oh. 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 a liberal policy. Yes, it came out. He didn't intend it to, but he did. The rich were less rich. No, no, no. But now, you accept <clears throat> that, do you? My duty, and I'm very proud that we put it this way and adhered to it. People, they are the enemies, and we must watch out for it, because they're trade unions. They used their power against their members. Trade unions. They made them, they made them, they made them come out on strike, strike when they didn't want to. Trade unions. They loved secondary picketing when they didn't want to. Who came to the rescue? It was those self-same liberals who propped up the most illiberal government of modern time. Oh, very much so. I've done a good deal of other speaking. People, they are the enemies, and we must watch out for it. Yes, people do know where they stand with us. Yes, they do know we're strong government. Yes, they do know we have a property-earning democracy, the like of which we've never had, which will give opportunities in the future we've never had before. Yes, I hope to go on and on.